Um, with reservations, with a brief comment. Sure, and please proceed. Uh, Mr. Speaker, I'm, I'm concerned about this resolution in regards to where it originated from. It, origina it originated from an effort to, to ask for $100 million to purchase the undeveloped lands around Turtle Bay, uh, Mr. Speaker, and I'm concerned in regards to the priorities within my community, Mr. Speaker. We have Kahuku High School, which um, is in the same area as, as the area here for Turtle Bay, Mr. Speaker. Whenever we get a good dose of rain, the kids in my community can't go to school, Mr. Speaker. And as I've mentioned numerous times before, in my community we have areas that are pushing 80% of the families cannot pay for the meals of their own kids who go to school there uh, because of the, per the pervasive poverty issues which um, are found in my community, Mr. Speaker. And my concern with this resolution is, is that it would misdirect the efforts of the limited resources that we have available to us at this time. And so we have, the, uh, this could end in the use of $100 million towards the purchasing of undeveloped land around, tur around Turtle Bay and would not direct those resources towards fixing the, num the, the host of issues that we have in regards to the faci school facilities that we have in the area, Mr. Speaker. And to solve the flooding issue for the Kahuku High School and surrounding community would cost about $14 million, Mr. Speaker. And I think that that should take priority over, over this effort. And I'm concerned that this measure would, would not place the, the priorities and the spending in regards to, uh, to my community, Mr. Speaker, and making sure that our kids um, get out of poverty. And that is going to primarily come through fixing the education system. So my concern is just where this would end up in priority, Mr. Speaker, and I should be, it should be ending poverty and fixing education, Mr. Speaker, not towards uh, purchasing land to do nothing with it. All right, thank you very much. 